I dreamed about this pass for two weeks in the last corner and in the last lap. To say the truth, I didn't expect him to pass me. He was more, more clever or more brave. Valentino, that last overtake, have you actually seen anybody else make an overtake at that corner? Uh, actually, he did it to me in 2007. Thank so. you, Casey. That's what I wanted to know. <laughs> I, I learned my lesson already. <laughs> this was before Lorenzo was in MotoGP. Six laps to go. Rossi passes Stoner in the final corner. Stoner went on to win the race, but Rossi played that card. He knew he could do it. It's unbelievable, I think, never happened before. After six races, we are equal points, but not two riders, three riders. Three riders on the same points after six races. Suddenly, one of them is in big trouble. After just a few laps, I was completely destroyed. I was very close to pulling in the pits and the bike was working really well but I just wasn't able to keep the pace. I couldn't uh, brake, you know, I was nearly falling in the front of the bike under brakes. You know, my legs cramping, everything, my stomach. Heat stroke, a virus. Stoner looks terrible after the race. It's a shame. He was the fastest guy out there today. Set the fastest lap on lap two. It could have been a three-way fight. Danny Pedrosa is also walking wounded. He fractured his femur when he crashed in the Mugello race. Then he re-injured his hip when he fell in qualifying in Barcelona. Unfortunately, it was on the right side. Again, one more shock on, on, this, on this area. This kind of injury needs time. Uh, everybody knows we don't have. Catalonia was Valentino Rossi's 99th Grand Prix victory. Can he make it 100 at the oldest circuit on the calendar? Assen is another of the world champion's favorite tracks. He's won here seven times. This is a, a, a special place for sure. Assen is uh, the place with more uh, history behind. Also my father uh, won here uh, with, uh, with 250. Pedrosa and Stoner both have fitness problems. Lorenzo is the threat. Another battle with, uh, with Jorg like in Barcelona is, uh, is, is too much especially for the old, uh, old people like my grandmother. <laughs> I make a good start from the pole position. I try to push a lot because I know Jorge have uh, more or less my same pace. Pedrosa and Stoner are ahead of you. Lorenzo's behind. You need to get away past Pedrosa and Stoner and keep pushing.
It's not like Catalonia. Third on the grid, sixth at the first corner. What's happening? You've got the speed to challenge Rossi, but now you've got four other riders ahead. Of you. 